everybody. Happy Wednesday. It is hump day. We're going to just get over that hump Yes, together, we, Yes, we will. We do, I everybody. like it. I like yeah. it. Uh, so, yeah, the most annoying TSA passengers. <laughs> I cannot even imagine. So they probably have a very long, exhaustive Yeah, list. I'm sure they do. <laughs> do you have any peeves? Any pet peeves? When I travel? Airport? Yeah. People getting too close to me. Ooh, okay. I don't like that. Yeah, I don't you like know, that either. Especially because there's already a lot of people, especially if you're traveling during like a peak time. Right, So right. like, just give me my space. I know nice. because we already don't have a lot of it. Right? Yeah, you've seen people like just come right up on you, and behind you in line. It's not good. Be now patient. you smell their breath and like, come on, brush your teeth. <laughs> yeah. All right. Be patient too, right? It's Be like, patient. It's stressful, the experience. Oh, it yeah. is. Yeah. It's like, take a deep breath. All right. Speaking of taking a deep breath, I know we, we were experiencing some more rain this morning and some more troubles in the road, so let's get out some Maria. All right, what's going on out there today? I think we're used to this now, I right? I think we are, <laughs> yeah. Kind of the routine. Every week we're seeing a new storm. We've got the rain falling. We kind of talked about this yesterday, right, that it would start during the overnight hours, and indeed it did. We're seeing some wet roads out there. It's still dark, so be extra careful, of course, if you are heading out the door now. We're seeing that uh, cold front move across Southern California. California. Mostly light to moderate rain. Some of the heavier stuff, the yellows and the reds, those radar returns staying up to the north. We're going to see rain today, some mountain snow, and then a little more instability as we get into tonight and tomorrow with the colder, more potent part of this storm system moving overhead. The satellite radar pictures, as we zoom in a little bit, you can see that band moving across parts of Ontario out towards Riverside. Orange County, we're seeing some pockets of drier weather. And that's going to be the case as we get to the latter part of the afternoon as that cold front continues to make its way east. 46 degrees right now, though, in Pasadena. It's going to be a cold storm, so you'll need that rain jacket or that uh, kind of fleece little sweatshirt that you have. 51 in Ontario, 50 in Santa Ana, 52 in Long Beach. Those winds coming out of the south and southwest will be gusty at times. Uh, we do have those wind advisories in effect, as well as some winter storm alerts up into our mountains. I'll go over that in just a moment. In the meantime, I'll Upper 50s to low 60s today, so big drop in those temperatures from yesterday's low 70s. 36 up into the mountains with snow, 55 in the high desert, 67, that's chilly, in Palm Springs. We'll go over all the other details on how much rain and all that good stuff when I come back. In the meantime, let's check in on the traffic conditions out there. We've got started that is our motto. She, she started this thing, Stu. She's it's really started a thing. It's a, it's a global movement. It is. It, it really is. is. Especially here in SoCal. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so Thank much. Thank you, man. All right, so as Maria and Stu said, the rain is back. We're on storm patrol all morning long as more showers drench already saturated SoCal today and tomorrow. That's right, Jen. Gigi Garcia standing by in the Pacific Palisades where the wet weather could ex exacerbate a landslide in one neighborhood. Good morning, Gigi.